Hello friends, subscribe technology and press the bell icon to never miss the updates. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel technology. So in this video, I will show you guys how to install Windows 10 operating system on your PC without any DVD or pen drive. So you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe our channel technology. Before installing new Windows 10 operating system on your computer, make sure that you have saved your downloads, documents, music, photos, desktop folders, files, any other location like drive like D or E, etc. So first of all, you need three things on your computer. Number one is Windows 10 ISO file. So I have already made a video on this topic on my channel. So I will give you that link to my video description so you can check out from there. Number 2 is EasyBCD. So to download EasyBCD freely, you have to go to this website, it's called newsmart.net. After that you have to scroll down and click on this register button to download freely. And now you have to put your email ID and name. So I'm going to put my name like technology and after that my email ID. And after that you have to click on this download button. So as you can see, the download is started. Number 3 is 10 to 20 GB free partition. Mean you have to create 10 to 20 GB free partition on your computer. So if you are using Windows 10, just go to your start menu and search over there this PC because uh, in Windows 10, uh, this PC means my computer. So you just type over there this PC and then click over there and right click on this PC and click on manage tab. Okay. After that, you will get computer management. Uh, dialog box on your screen so as you can see here is a computer management option so I'm going to click on this sticks management tab and after that I have to create one new volume for uh, the Windows 10 OS so what you have to do you need to right click over there and click on sync volume so right now in my e drive is 90 GB free so I'm going to select over there 20 GB the amount means 20,741 and after that click on screen uh, string and after that as you can see one allocated partition created so you have to click on new simple volume then next the next the next and again finish so it's formatting as you can see so here is a new 20 GB uh, free space as you can see so if you are using Windows 7 then you have to go to your start menu same way and right click on your my computer and click on this manage tab and after that you have to go to the disk management tab and right click on any drive and click on sync volume after that you have to choose uh, the amount is 20,000 means 20 GB after that one unlocated partition is created over there so click on new simple volume same way and after that finish so as you can see it's formatting so if i'll go to my my computer as you can see one 20 gb near about 20 gb volume is created over there so now you have to install easy bcd on your computer so just click on next and then i agree then install so after that uncheck this easy bcd and click on finish so now you have to extract this Windows 10 ISO file on that free partition. Okay. So I will going to click on extract here because uh, I have copied this uh, Windows 10 ISO file on my free partition. So just click on extract here written after done. So it's extracting as you can see. So if so here is my free partition as you can see 20 GB. So I am extracting under this uh, drive. So after extract will done, you have to uh, just open EasyBCD on your computer. And after that click on this OK button. And here is the EasyBCD. So you have to click on Edit Boot menu. And now as you can see, it's showing my current OS which is Windows 10. So don't do any changes over there. Otherwise it will crash your main operating system. So now you have to click on Add New Entry and then click on WinP. 
and put the new voice name like windows 10 installer i will put in my case after that you have to choose boot.wim file from path so just go to that free partition and after that go to under sources folder and after that click on choose this boot.im file so now you have to click on this add new entry okay so click on add entry now you have to wait few seconds so as you can see it's done windows 10 installer added boot menu successfully so now you have to click on edit boot menu as you can see one uh, uh, new windows 10 installer is added so now just go to your run box and type over there ms config and after that click on ok and if you will go to the boot you can see your uh, two boot menu over there so now you have to restart your computer from your start menu so after restart your computer you you will get this screen like this so windows 10 is my main operating system and windows 10 installation is the installer file so you have to choose that option and after that it will automatically reroute your computer and start with windows 10 installer so you have to wait for a few seconds so as you can see it's loading so as you can see it's loading successfully so if you want to install then you have to click on next so if you don't know how to install windows 10 on your computer then i have already made a video on this topic on my channel just check out on my channel also i will give you that link to my video description so you can watch it from there so i hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or questions then comments down below i will see you guys in the next one next video take care